Welcome, pilots! I previously released a video on fitting the Confessor for running high-security combat sites. At the conclusion of the video, I expressed some disappointment that I wasn't able to come up with a single versatile fit using beam lasers. Later, while producing a similar video on fitting the Hakati, I had some thoughts on how I might be able to improve those Confessor fits. I mentioned that I'd post an update if things went as planned, so here it is. A quick note before I show the fit. For those on Facebook, I've set up a Facebook page where I'll be posting semi-regular updates on my progress on upcoming video series. I've linked it from the main EVE Online page on my website over at RileyEntertainment.com. On the Tactical Destroyers webpage, I've added the revised unified tank fit for the Confessor. This fit manages to keep Tech 2 small focused beam lasers, though it does drop one of the heat sinks for a damage control. The active armor tank uses two small armor repairs while managing to stay cap stable by equipping two cap rechargers, a power diagnostic system, and a capacitor control circuit rig. If you're willing to bling out your fit a little, you could use two Corelli B-type armor repairs to improve the armor repair rate even further. The one combat site that's still surprisingly difficult is the Angel 4 of 10, the occupied mining colony. While the Confessor has the right resist profile against the Angel Cartel, its damage output is limited to EM and Thermal. So while it was still able to comfortably complete the site, it took significantly longer to destroy the Domination Excavator than I'd like. The second room of the Angel Vigil site can be quite devastating with the incoming damage. This fit handles it fairly comfortably so long as you use the Blitz approach. I even had the time to use the tractor beam on Pat Weed's wreck, allowing me to loot it before warping out. The second room of the Sancha Vigil site can also be quite devastating, unless you're able to deal with three spider drones. This fit handles this room quite comfortably as well, taking up the spider drones with multi-frequency crystals. Ooh, look at those faction drops! Huh, true Sancha coding modules. Never mind that. From my perspective, this unified fit effectively replaces the Angel and Sancha face tank fits I had mentioned in the previous video. It can be used in all high security combat sites against all pirate factions. Notice that I've included a handful of modules in the cargo hold. This provides some additional options for when you're fighting against Garistas or Serpentis, where you don't need as strong of a tank. I have one more video coming, where I'll be taking a deep dive on the Spipple. This will finish up the video series on fitting tactical destroyers for high security combat sites. I'm currently in the midst of releasing a 13 part series detailing all Sanchez Nation combat sites. I have similar series for Serpentis, Garistas, Angel Cartel, and Blood Raiders. You can find all of my EVE Online content in the gaming section of my website over at RileyEntertainment.com. So stay tuned to Riley Entertainment and smash that like button if you enjoy my content.